The Pac-12 volleyball season gets underway this weekend. News 4 Tucson's David Kelly tells us tonight it's going to look a lot like the high school volleyball season did here in Arizona this past fall. This is what high school volleyball looked like in the pandemic fall of 2020. All the players wearing masks during play. It is what you will see in the winter of 2021 as well in the Pac-12 when the U of A begins competition on Friday. The NCAA gave us an option. If we're not to wear masks, we were going to continue to be in a high risk category. And as a result of that, the Pac-12 Medical Advisory Board voted unanimously 12 nothing to require masks be worn during play. I mean, we've been playing in masks since last August, so the masks are what they are. I think this was a fairly controversial decision. And by that, Wildcats head coach Dave Rubio means that although the conference's medical advisors were on board with masks and he was also on board with masks, not all of the coaches in the Pac-12 liked the idea. As much as I think of my colleagues don't want the players to wear masks for the matches, personally, that I think the way that we're going to get through the season if, if we're wearing masks during the sport. It'll be a season right now of 22 matches with the normal two matches per weekend. But the abnormal is U of A will play the same team in both of those matches, all while wearing a mask. For me, being my senior year, I'm literally going to do whatever it takes to be able to play all of our games and not have games canceled on account of us. My hope that at the end of the season, we're going to look back and say that was a good decision. The Wildcats will open their season in Salt Lake City, where they will play Utah twice, Friday and Sunday, and then they'll come home here to McHale Center next weekend to host Washington. Those matches will be on Friday and Saturday. We've got you covered here on campus. I'm David Kelly, News 4, Tucson.